Hey, welcome to Analyze with Power. I'm so glad you're watching this video right now. So you're watching it because you want to learn how to create a heat map in Power BI. And once you see how we do it, it's very simple. You're going to be like, oh, this is amazing. So quick to do. So let's, let's head on. Let's get it. So I have a data model that I created. It's very basic. It's got data from this site. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at it. The first thing we are going to do is we're going to insert a matrix in this example. We're trying to view a heat map of our cells by day of the week and hour of the day. So let's go ahead and say, oops, hour, let's get that in there. That's going to be your rows. And then day of week is our column and then sales is our value so right now you can see the sales but we need to make it look like a heat map right so you can you can visually see okay, so at what time do we need more employees for example right that's not the only thing that you can see but when are we selling more by time of day and week, day of week? Um, let's go ahead and, oops, my bad. Let's go ahead and change this to um, minimal. And let's increase the font size just a little bit so we can see a little, little bit more. And that may have been a little bit too much, but let's do a little bit smaller. There you go. So what we're going to do is we're going to use conditional formatting to achieve what we're trying to do. So let's go to conditional formatting. We're going to do background color and font color. If you do it this way, it's it's done. It's automatically done by from red to green, depending on you know green will be the highest. Um, but we can change it to look like the one we had before. So it was light green to or dark green and then we can do the same here change that that and there you go let's go ahead and take out our some totals and there you have it now we can see sales by time of day in a heat map and by day of week so i hope you enjoyed this video and that you learned so if you have any questions just hit me up and i'll see you next time